Well, hi guys and welcome back to the Gourmet Granddad channel. It's me, Rog here, and tonight for midweek meal I'm going to do a peri peri chicken. You could call it Nando's, but it's not Nando's. Uh, I'll show you all these ingredients. Um, I've checked this out pretty well, so I, c I can't be far wrong, not really. So, uh, we're obviously, we're going to need some salt and pepper. I've got here some black pepper already ground. I've got some sea salt. We're going to need some barbecue sauce. I've got about half a cup. And two teaspoons of smoked paprika. One teaspoon of this Coleman's mustard powder. Two teaspoons of chili flakes. About three tablespoons full of this uh, Lian Perrin's Worcestershire sauce. Then we've got um, two teaspoons of dried oregano. That's there. Four cloves of garlic that have been crushed. The juice from two limes. And we're going to need some cooking oil. So we're going to mix all these together. We'll get a bowl ready. Mix all these together very nicely and then we can marinate the chicken and leave it for at least one hour, longer if you've got time or even overnight if you want. And then we can get cracking with the cooking part of the video. Making sure to give our sauce a really good mix. And it gives those chili flakes a chance to soften up and release their flavor. Then we can go in with the chicken. So here we have the chicken portions that we're going to use. I've got various types. I've got some wings, um, drumsticks, breast, uh, portion, the thicker portions like this one. I'm just going to cut through just a little bit, make a little incision there, just so that the sauce flavour goes through. That will give this one a little cut. The smaller pieces will be fine really. Then the chicken can go into the sauce. Making sure to get everything coated quite nicely. Cover this with clean film. Then we we'll just leave it to rest. All marinade. So the chicken's had a good couple of hours now, and a lovely little marinade in this. Uh, all these ingredients. Now I'm going to use this this um, foil baking tray here. Place the chicken in there and just sort of spread it about really. Now this is going to go into the gas oven, my oven's a gas oven, and it's going to be preheated to gas mark six. And I'm going to put these chicken portions in there for about 40 minutes. I will take them out and give them a check part way through to make sure that they're not completely drying out or burning or you know, just keep an eye on them really, because obviously the smaller pieces are going to cook much faster than the big pieces. And uh, yeah, we don't want to spoil these, so now off they go to the oven. So after 40 minutes, we end up with this, delicious chicken portions. Served up with delicious fries, cooked in an air fryer. I'll leave a link above to another recipe and also a lovely crispy salad. Now it's time for our taste test. Here's a little chicken wing, we'll have a nibble. Very succulent, full of flavour bit of a kick to it with the chilli flakes but I don't mind spicy. Please try this for yourself, it's really good. And uh, thanks for watching this latest video of mine. Please uh, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. 
thank you to all my subscribers and thank you to all the people that view this video and all the others and uh, yeah give me a thumbs up and a share and I shall see you all again next time I'm off for a nibble bye for now